Hey, my name is Stuart Brunt, and in this video, I want to quickly tell you how to find your measurement value. Alright, so you're given a problem, you're given your transmission range, your transmission value, and your measurement range, and you want to find your measurement value. So what do you do? You're going to use this formula right here. Oftentimes, this formula, this is actually going to be just an M, but I used the MV because it's more specific measurement value. Um, but anyways, um, plug and chug. So you got to know what these letters mean. TV right here, that's your transmission value, 18.826, just plug it in. Um, you're going to have your transmission range lower value. Transmission range lower value in this case is 4 milliamps, so we're just going to use the 4. Um, and then transmission range upper and transmission range lower, you're subtracting those, so upper and lower. Okay, then you're going to multiply whatever that is, okay, times whatever the... Uh, measurement range upper range value is minus your measurement range lower value and in this case that's going to be 300 degrees Celsius and 0 degrees Celsius so now you're going to multiply it together and in this case um, we didn't add anything because our measurement range lower value was 0 but it's important to know that if this was you know a higher number than 0 you can't just cancel this out right here because of this bracket because you're going to have to multiply whatever this number is here from this division and this here from this multiple or from this subtraction and you're gonna get a number and you're gonna add whatever that number is to this measurement range lower value okay so once you do that you're gonna get 277.8 degrees Celsius and you know that it's gonna be in degrees Celsius because you're looking for your measurement value and your measurement range is in degrees Celsius so that's how I remember to know that I'm using the correct uh, description here Alright, well I hope this has helped. Um, if you have any questions or comments, leave them in the links below and have a good one.